not out of the woods yet. Oh, man, am I glad to be out? Ugh, not so glad anymore. Not surprised either. It's what we came for. Let's have it. It's all about that treasure. And on we go. Right. Feels good to get it done. Yeah, almost makes up for the soaked socks and bug bites. Ah, <sighs> that's better. Let's hit it. Sure. And away we go. Are you guys excited to visit Altisha or what? I guess. I'm so jealous. We're not going on vacation. Oh, yeah. You're right. There is? Something wrong? What? No, I'm fine. I I'm not jealous. I just had a lot of fun hanging out with you guys. But that'll all be in the past once we hit Kayam. What are you talking about? We can hang out anytime, right? Yeah. Let's pull over for a sec. How come? Well, I gotta give the driver a break every now and then, if you say so. 
Wonder why no one ever thought of that before. Because no one ever had a little sister along for the ride. <clears throat> that was a tight squeeze. Sorry for cramping your style. Calm down. I'm just kidding. Not my fault you're too big for the back seat. in the air. Sea breeze. We're on the water. Wow. It's beautiful. Picture perfect. Get a load of this beautiful view. Yeah, like something out of a dream. Just don't fall asleep on me. up ahead hmm. some piece of work right there the rivers run wide out here so the bridges run long guess I'll see it when we cross want to get a closer look at what Morning! Who's ready to kick some ass? So, you're the one doing all the cooking. More or less. Gladdy, don't you help? <sighs> Knocked? Uh, on occasion. What occasion? I do my part! I always set the table. That's some arrangement you guys have here. the place sure is thanks for the lift Ignis my pleasure <sighs> can't wait to see my buddy Talcott Say we head on up. 
Ought to be a nice view, if a bit blustered. What's up? Knew it was y'all. Recognize the purr of that engine anywhere. Thanks for the ride. It was fun. How's the boat? Papa's tinkering away. Reckon he'll be tinkering for some time. Trouble at sea. Seen her share by the looks of her. Some parts we can fix, others need replacing. An overhaul. Don't y'all worry. Papa ain't going nowhere till the job's done. Parts won't fetch themselves, though. Was kind of hoping y'all wouldn't mind helping out with that. We're at your disposal. To tell the truth, we already got a couple hands on deck. Dustin and Monica. Those two have been real swell. Managed to gather just about everything we need. You can depend on the Crown's Guard. Trouble is, they ain't had much luck finding a certain something by the name of Mithril. Apparently, the stuff's hard to come by around these parts. At least according to the little fella from the city. Talca? You betcha. Sharp as a tack, that one. Could tell y'all more about the stuff than I could. We'll be sure to ask. Papa's down on the dock. Now, if y'all excuse me, I'm gonna grab my tools and ski daddle. Got a garage to look after. Prince Noctis! Hey! Our house is over here! Right this way! Cindy might have told you already, but she needs a very special kind of ore called Mithril to fix the boat. Remember the waterfall? I read in Grandpa's notebook, there's some ruins near a lake just north of there. It said you'll find Mithril inside! About that lake, pretty sure he was talking about the Vesper Pool. I asked Monica to look into it. And she told me the road leading there is under Imperial Lockdown. You'll want to be prepared for anything. So, how's that coming along? Yeah, just give us a second. Uh, okay. I'll be inside then. So, yeah. Gonna have to ask you to handle this boat business without me. Say what? I got some business of my own to deal with. be long not long enough for you to miss me
The waterfall cave was right around here. That means the lake should be somewhere north of here. Be wary, though. When we go, the Empire seems to follow. Wait. What happened to under-Imperial lockdown? They all but turned the key and left the gates open for us, as if awaiting our arrival. And if anyone's waiting for us? I bet it's that guy. Chancellor Izunia. Can't complain, as long as he lets us in. Who's to say he'll let us out? Not to mention we're a man down. Would that the Marshal were with us. Oh yeah. Whatever happened to that guy? As I understand it, he's put his tomb raiding on hold to help the hunters take care of some troublesome beasts. No rest for the immortal. An imperial blockade. Must be doubly cautious. Right, no Gladio, no room for error. Onward. Right. Ah, <sighs> I could get used to having all this room back here. I'll let the big guy know you said so. I should really get a shot of that spot before it's too late. Yeah, go for it. Woohoo! Where do we go from here?
Take a shot from here. Good call. Now it's picture time. Ready or not? <laughs> oh! Love the lighting! Rather sultry. Yeah. Everything in order? Yep. Mm hmm. This will be quick. What's the forecast? Clear skies, with the temperature rising. Nice. Opening. 
flies when you're having fun. Gentlemen, what a pleasant surprise. Ugh, told you he'd be waiting. With my Imperial friends, no less. Splendid. But fear not. I'll put in a good word. Well, come along then. Don't stray too far, lest you get left behind. And surely, you'd rather avoid unnecessary scuffles. Seeing as you're now a trio. Oh dear. Touchy subject. One we won't discuss with you. Then let's discuss why you're here. Hmm, it can't be archaeology. Mithril, perhaps? This guy's reading our thoughts. Mithril. It's a precious resource, you see. We can't just let anyone get their hands on it. But you'll help us get ours on it, right? <gasps> I never said that. Of course you didn't. Where is the fun in that? I thought you'd rather dig it up yourselves. Fear not. I'll be but a moment. A moment doing what? Beats me. Hmm. All clear. Go ahead. Thank you. 